Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Should I just start saying that? Welcome back to my channel. Sounds weird. Comment down below an entry you guys would like a uh, intro that you guys would think would fit my channel. Uh, but anyways, welcome back to my channel. Uh, today, I'm freaking out. Um, it, it's time. If you didn't see my last NASCAR Heat 5, uh, video, we, uh, we made it to the championship in both the trucks and the cup. We missed out by quite a few points. Uh, we basically needed the win and we didn't get it. So, it, no Xfinity Series championship uh, for us. Not that it matters. I don't think we're even going to be in the Xfinity Series next year. Uh, but as you can see, these are our uh, championship four drivers for the trucks. We got myself, the 16 of Austin Hill, the 98 of Grant Emfinger, and Grant's teammate... The 13 of Johnny Sauter. So, uh, also, as we look at the Cup Series, it's me versus the three Joe Gibbs cars. Denny, Denny Hamster, Denny Hamlin, sorry, Bushy Bushy, <coughs> Kyle Bushy Bushy, uh, Eminem's man, Candy Man, whatever you call him, and Martin T. Rex Jr. Rawr. Uh, so yes, I am being quite uh, stupid right now. But anyways, that is your championship four for both series that I am in. Let's go get it. <sighs> How does this keep on happening? It's a really bad qualifying at Phoenix. That is bad. We are starting 30th. I did not even look at where our rivals are starting. So, uh, I guess let's get into it. Oh, I can't believe it. Just cannot believe it. Yep, I see Johnny Sauter up in the lead. I'm stuck on the top where I don't want to be and um, four Y. Four Y Are you serious? Harm it. Harm it. Bruh. Come the horseshoe, which is something that the actual drivers do. About to see our first championship four contender, Johnny Sauter, who I thought was starting this race in the lead, was not. We get around him. Austin Hill in uh, eighth. There's Grant M. Finger. Grant M. Finger is in second. I think that's him up there. This could actually be him. Nope, it's Sheldon Creed. Confirmation. Um, Grant and Finger is in 
second. Which means I, and I have to beat them. I have to beat the other, you have to beat the other three to win the championship. Zane Smith, my old truck teammate, Todd Gilland, who was in the playoffs, he got knocked out after we uh, got in. The two rookie truck drivers, Christian Eckes and Ralph Ra Raphael Ressard and yep, Grant M. Finger. Second. We slide Lessard Lessard up the track and we are going to clear him for P3 with five laps to go. Can we reach Grant M. Finger to get another truck championship and possibly even Ben Rhodes to win the race and possibly our final truck start. I don't think it's possible to catch up to Ben to Ben, but ooh, you better believe that I'm going to catch Grant and make this a little exciting for this championship. I ain't going to just let him drive off with it. No sir, that is not what I do. Not here. Not when I'm so close. Going to cut the dog leg again. Three laps to go now. The gap. At one car length, less than a car length, side by side with Enfinger, our final rival for the championship out of turn two. We're going to clear him going into turn three. Going to cut the dog leg once more. Two to go. One pull away from Grant a bit. Going to catch to Ben a bit, but I think it's over for the race win. Because lap traffic too far ahead of Ben. I think this is going to end in a Ben Rhodes victory. But it'll but as it stands, as of right now, as we hit the white flag, final lap. One lap to go in the season for the truck series. Ben's not gonna let the lap traffic hold him up into the final two corners. Checker flag in the air. Ben Rhodes wins at Phoenix, the season finale. We win the race. We win the championship with a second place finish over our championship rivals. There it is. By one point over Grant M. Finger, we win the championship. What an amazing race this has been. able to celebrate our championship, our final truck start, moving on, to just the Cup Series rides. And what a, a way to end our truck career. So now, it's time to go and race for a cup championship. This is uh, probably...
probably the no most nervous thing I've done in a bit. Uh, but, uh, yeah. Team Penske really wants wanted us to join their team. We accepted their invite, but we also have contract sign, uh, new season contract options with Stuart Haas Racing, my current team at Hendrick, Joe Gibbs Motorsports, uh, skip, Joe Gibbs Racing, and Chip Ganassi Racing. We'll see what happens. I think I'm going to ask you guys what you think I should be in it. Uh, what team I should be with. I think I'm going to look at their stats really quickly to give you an idea what team you might want to... Uh, what team you guys think I should be with. So, uh, Chip Ganassi... Uh, gives $100,750 uh, per race. Uh, Hendrick Motorsports, which I'm with right now, gives the same. Uh, Joe Gibbs Racing, same race payout. Uh, same race payout for Stuart Haas Racing. And Team Penske actually gives an extra 100. Over 100 wins at the top level for Team Penske. Two championships and over 50 wins at SHR, Stuart Haas Racing. Only one championship for JGR. And over 175 race wins. Hendrick Motorsports. Um, probably the best team out there with over 200 win plus wins. And uh, several... Uh, 12 championships, so, yeah, and then Chip Ganassi, uh, zero championships, but quite a few wins for that team. Tell me what team you think I should be on next season. And let's get going. In the finale event for the NASCAR Cup Series. So starting 39th, and I believe Hamilton is in the lead. Yes, he is. Dang, that is uh, actually pretty bad. We got 22 laps to try and catch him up, up to him, and make the pass. On the bottom, we're going to make up several places. Wow. Um, already up to, uh, up to bowling for 13th with Newman. Now bowling, uh, Kozlowski for 10th. Truex, who is our first rival for the championship we get by him we almost lost Kansas uh, the can the race at Kansas to him now diving down Kyle Bush up next Candyman. I'm going to split the dog leg once more doesn't really help us against Kyle we're going to get around him though 
now going to go to work on Harbeck, who's won here several times. And Tyler Reddick making a move on Matt DiBenedetto. We're going to make the move on Matty D as well. Unfortunately, cannot get underneath the Reddick there, but we're going to get the draft and make the catapult halt. The catapult, I can't say it. Catapult shoe shot underneath them. We're going to clear them through the dog leg underneath Hamlin. We're going side by side with our final rival in that ahead of us for not just the race lead but also the championship lead Hamlin the only other championship four ahead of us as we come up the track we're still side by side but we're going to take it going into turn one take the lead on lap six of 22 Now, just working on trying to finish this race ahead of Hamlin. Me and Hamlin, the only two in the top five that are going for the championship, except Truex or Kyle. Uh, Kind of. No. Uh, Newman overtook Kyle. So Kyle having to uh, go around six cars, including myself, uh, if he wants to get into the champ into the uh, position for the championship. Truex Jr. Not sure if he's even in the top 10 still. But right now, my main rival at the moment for this championship is Denny Hamlin. Less than a second and a half is the gap between the two of us. trying to win the final race to make it 19 race wins Tyler Reddick takes his chance to get underneath Denny Hamlin Reddick probably the only driver uh, who seems fast enough other than myself obviously who could possibly rupture this championship Now trying to get to the lap traffic to use as to use uh, it as defense. Hopefully we don't get held up by the lap traffic because that will uh, be absolutely devastating and just plain annoying at the same exact time. Just under a s two seconds. The gap between us and Reddick. If we go up the track a bit, two seconds is the gap. Trying to keep it that way and even uh, grow the gap as well when how f forcing us to stay underneath the yellow line going to get around hit how when how John Hunter Nemechek and Corey LaJoy now coming up on Justin Haley is this lap traffic going to affect Tyler Reddick see that he is struggling 
Hamlin now uh, almost had the uh, run to try and take the second position away from from Reddick as we continue to lap the uh, back markers. Major fight for this championship, having to start at the back. The truck championship, yes, I know, was also fought from the back, but we did not come to win that race. We only were able to finish P2. We still won the championship, but it wasn't the race win. Trying for our, believe, 65th race victory. Probably 66th at this point. Five laps away from it, and five laps to go in the season. Five laps to go. Of this race. Five laps to go till the championship is decided. We have a 6.23 second gap over Tyler Reddick. A very comfortable gap. At this point. Now four laps to go. Coming to three to go. Is it going to be the number nine reigning supreme once again? Three to go. Here in the championship. Ryan Blaney holding up David Reagan in front of us. Will this battle have any effect? Will the battle of for 20th have any effect over us? Going to watch as David Reagan uh, makes the move on Ryan Blaney. We're going to overtake both of them. Two laps to go now. Coming to the white flag. White flag in the air. Final lap of this championship. Final lap of the season. Possibly final lap with Hendrick Motorsports. As we over... As we lap Jimmy Johnson, we accidentally force him wide. Through the final two corners of the season. It has been... Dominancy over the others. We win the championship rightfully into our hands. And we are going to celebrate like champions. With a sensational burnout here in the desert. An absolute amazing race. Denny Hamlin very close to winning his first championship but we in the number nine reign supreme and uh, our engine ends up blowing out much sooner than I wish it would have can't really move the car all that much so Let's go ahead and see if we can't just wheel this thing down to
into victory lane. We're going to see if we can't burn our tires a bit for our fellow drivers. Whoops! Brad Kislowski. Always in the way whenever I end up crashing. It always seems that way. As we pull in to go celebrate. We are the cup champions! Let's go! So, uh, remember to uh, le cast your votes in the comments. What team do you think I should be on? I'll leave those those teams in the description down below so you can check it out for yourself. Uh, unfortunately, this does bring an end to the season. And with that, the my uh, truck career and Xfinity career now we're focused on one series cup the top series let's continue to push for those championships remember to subscribe to my youtube channel we finally passed 75 remember to leave a like rating on this video and we'll see you in the next one see you there